You've been blowing up my phone all day. I was in a team meeting, Jada. I'm sorry, I just really needed to talk to you. And what is so important that you cost us money? Well? I'm pregnant, Kyle. Huh? Well, I'm sorry, what? I beg your pardon? You're pregnant. I'm pregnant, Kyle, and it's yours. No, it ain't. I told you to take that pill last time, Jada. That's your responsibility. It takes two to make a baby, Kyle, remember that. So I didn't even have the money to get it. Are you serious? You could have asked your aunt, your friend, anybody. Your responsibility. Don't yell at me, Kyle. I'm just surprised as you are. Okay, well, you have to get rid of it. I'm not ready to be a father. I told you to take the pill, and you didn't. So get rid of it. You could have bought it, too. Okay, I'm broke, Jada. Okay, we are broke. And I'm even broker than last week is because I was sent home again. Because of you. Don't. You let me go. Get rid of it, Jada. Okay? I'm warning you. Get rid of it now. It's in my body, Kai. And I'll do what I want with my body of keeping my baby. What do you want to do that for? I'm broke. You're broke. What are we going to feed the baby? Top ramen? I thought you loved me, Kai. Why don't you want to have our baby? We've been drifting apart anyway. What are you talking about? I saw that text you sent Samantha. God I didn't mean that. I was just so angry with you at the time. Yeah, whatever. If you knew all of that, then why, why stay with me? The same reason you're knocked up now. How dare you? That was wrong. Ah! Huh? How dare you put your hands on me? How dare you put your hands on me? Get off of me! Get rid of it. No. Get rid of it, Jada. Get rid of it. Why would you why would you hit me, huh? Are you gonna get rid of it? Are you gonna get rid of it? Get off of me! Get off! I don't know what's wrong with you. I don't know what's wrong with you. I don't know why you make me do this. You want to slap me in the face? Huh? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, huh? I'm not trying to be aggressive with you here. Just get rid of it, okay? Ma'am, if you can hear me, I'm not ready to be a father. You're not ready to be a. We're broke, okay? Shada. Just listen to me. Get rid of it now. Get rid of it now. I told you, get rid of it now. Thanks. You want to stop me? In a hey. Okay. Jada. Jada. Here. Wake up, okay? Please wake up. Jada. Jada, wake up. Baby, please wake up. Are you okay? Please. Wake up, okay? Hey, please wake up. Jada, come on. Baby, please, wake up. Come on. Oh, right Jada, there. Jada. Okay. Get down on the ground. Okay. Get down on the ground. Okay. Down on my the ground. I said get down on the ground. Stay down on the ground. She's unconscious, okay? Can you check on her, please? Please check on her. That's what he's doing. That's what he's doing. He's calling. Be still. She needs an ambulance, man. Please send an ambulance down doing. to 333 Main Street. We have a woman that's unresponsive. It is not okay to exchange communication with abuse. Jada succumbed to her injuries and died with her unborn child. Kai got sentenced to death penalty after serving eight years in prison for manslaughter and feticide. This tragic ending could have been a happy one had Kai made better choices. Hey Jada, is everything okay? Well, yeah, it's just, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you at work. No, it's, it's okay. I was sent home early. Is it because of me? Oh my God, I'm so sorry. Calm down. I got sent home early. I was promoted today to district manager, so I wanted to come home and celebrate with you. Really? C congratulations, baby. That's amazing. No, thank you. Now, tell me what's going on. Well, um, 
My period came kind of late and uh... But pregnant? No, Kai. I went to the clinic and my doctor said that the day after pill could cause a shift in my cycle, so... Oh. What's wrong? I mean, I thought you would be happy about this. No, I mean, I know we're not ready, but... I mean, who is? I just got the promotion and... Just whenever you're ready. Kai, that is so sweet of you. No, I mean it. I mean, I can't see myself with anybody else. I also can't see anyone bearing our children, so... I love you. I love you too, Kai. And I mean, one day when we are prepared, we can actually have kids. But now let's just spend as much time as we can together before we bring that next layer into our relationship. You're right. I know things have been rocky for a while, but I promise things are going to change for us. I absolutely cannot see a future without you. I will always be by your side. The moral of the story is, take accountability for your actions. You are responsible for what you do in life. If you're not ready to be a parent, stay protected and practice abstinence. Communicate with your partner about your boundaries before you are forced to cross them.